Right, we're here in the wax yard and we just got to go find the key for the chair store because in the chair store is where the angels have just been moved. We're here in the chair store, I don't know if you can hear me very well. I'm sorry that if I'm shouting at you, I am, but only because it's really noisy. Anyway, this is the chair store, this is where we've just moved the angels of nativity into. Um, yeah, we keep chairs here. I don't know if you can see me, it's raining, um, but I'm just going over to the cathedral because apparently the angels in nativity have been set up. I don't have a windscreen wipers or glasses. If only that was a real invention. Oh my gosh, gap in the market. Hi guys, um, I'm here in the spy crossing and behind me is the Angels in Nativity, which our caretakers have been putting up this morning. So Peter Rush came in um, at the weekend on Friday and over the weekend to uh, fix them up um, and repaint them, some of them, because they were getting a little bit dusty. Um, yeah, I'll show you actually, instead of showing you my face. Let me just refocus it. Some kids have found something. I think they're in the Christmas chair, which is really sweet. Anyway, um, yeah, tell me that's not the best mannequin challenge you've ever seen. I can't focus it. They're so still. Um, imagine if they're like real people under there. Not that they are, but they might be. I'm joking, they're not. Um, yeah, so here's some fun facts for you. So Peter Rush, he is, um, well he was, um, a freelance illustrator from the BBC. Um, he did like Jack and Ori and things like that. Um, he designed and commissioned these pieces um, for the Nativity and the Angels in, I think it was 1989 and in 2004. So they first started off with three of them and then slowly they've built up over time. Um, and he comes each year to kind of fix up any broken fingers and things like that. So it's very good actually. If you've, if you've never seen them, I think you should come down and have a look yourself. Anyway, I'm gonna stop filming myself now because I look like a robot I'm talking to myself and everybody's staring at me. Anyway, if you're wondering, the nativity display and everything will be kept up until the 2nd of February. Um, I believe that is Candlemas. So, for the time being, I'm going to go get myself a cup of tea. Okay, bye. Tomorrow we meet the Chorister Bishop. Um, are you really nervous or are you, do you think you're all ready for it? I think I'm ready. 